Hi guys, it's Beth and welcome back to my channel. And today I am sharing a fun little diamond painting kit I got. And this is from a shop called Everyday E-Deals and they have all kinds of diamond painting and some other crafty items. And so they were kind enough to send me this cute little, it's like their little keychains. Mama's. And I've wanted to try diamond painting before, but I've always been intimidated by the big projects. I don't know that I would have time to just to finish one. I know a lot of the people that I've watched on YouTube who've been working on them, it's taken them a while. So I got some little projects to tie out, try out first. So we have a little llama keychain set. And there are four. It's sunglasses. Ellie is going to work on these with me and she has already picked out her two. <laughs> and then it also comes with a little keychain set, like a little, the fobs that you can attach it to something, backpacks or whatever. And then it comes with all of the little rhinestones that you need. There's, there's 12 rhinestones. Yeah, Ellie says there's 12 different colors and they're all sorted and they're numbered, which makes it very easy to, um, match up where they're going to go. And then in this last little bag, there is the little um, tool that you use to pick up the rhinestones and apply them to your project. And a tray to store the ones, the rhinestones that you're currently working on. And then storage baggies, so whatever color you're working on, if you don't finish and you need to pack things away, you can just put them in the baggie to keep them together. So. I just wanted to share the the projects before we got started and then we'll show you a little bit of us working on them and then we'll show you our finished projects at the end. Okay, so these are our completed keychains, and Ellie and I worked on them and finished them up when we were camping. I just haven't had a chance to share the finished products yet, and Ellie did most of these, actually. Um, she did, I think Avery did just a little bit on one of these pink llamas, and then Ellie finished up that one, plus she did this one. So Ellie did pretty much three out of the four Look how pretty these are. And they went super quick. And it's one of those things that it's, it's a repetitive task, but it's almost, it was very relaxing for me for some reason. Even though you're dealing with like these little bitty gems, it was, I think the repetition was very calming and relaxing. And I enjoyed, you know, the fact that I could do it while I was watching, you know, videos or, you know, talking with my family. Ellie did it while she watched videos sometimes too. And then I love that, you know, you have a little chain here and then the clasp. It could be a keychain, it could be a backpack charm. I know Ellie 
is excited to use hers as a backpack backpack charm. And I thought these would make really cute gifts that, you know, what Ellie and Avery might not use, we could gift for, stick inside birthday gifts for friends or whatnot for them. So I just thought they would be super cute. So again, the company that I worked with on these was called Everyday E-Deals. And I will include a link below to their website, and I will also include a link to this specific product. Um, they have a lot of big diamond paintings, and then they also have some smaller projects as well. And I love these smaller projects. Just like I said, for me, the big ones just kind of seem overwhelming. I'm not good at you know, coming back to something all the time, like doing a little bit here and a little bit there. Like I'm one, like I want to do it. I want to get it, get it done. And I think it would have been stressful for me to have like one of the bigger paintings, but I loved having the little ones because like I said, we knock these out pretty quickly and it just was nice knowing that, you know, it wouldn't be an unfinished project forever. So um, but I really enjoyed the super fun. Ellie really enjoyed them and would love to do some more. So I may have to look into that for her, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this little deviation from some of the normal crafting that I do, but I did want to share these with you because they were super fun and they're super cool. So again, information will be in the description box below. Let me know if you have any questions. Otherwise, thank you guys so much for your time today and hope you all have a crafty day.